because it's Michael Scott, so it's just automatically funny. But he's listening to Lady Gaga. Uh, that's why it's funny. I have fun. What's going on, everybody? How are you doing today? So here I am in Kentwood, Louisiana, home of Britney Spears. Britney Spears. Britney Spears. Britney Jean Spears. This is her hometown. And here's the Kentwood Historical and Cultural Museum. And it's closed. Inside, they have a huge exhibit all about Britney Spears. All in here, and it's closed. It's, it's closed a lot. It's a small town. It's tough. I made the drive, and it's closed. However, thanks to a lovely lady named Faye, they set it up, and I'm going to be in there in one moment with you alone walking around showing you some Britney stuff. They've got costumes, stage props, gold records, and most importantly, her bedroom in here. It's all locked up, but we're going in. This is a rarity. This place is never open. It's hard to get in here. Thank you, Faye, for putting up with my frantic phone calls over, <laughs> of course, for a few days trying to set this up. It was a lot. I did it. Yeah, let's, let's go. Oh. I did meet Brittany once, uh, here. And I was young, she was young. I spent a whole day with her. I have lots of other photos. That's the only one I can find, but this was before digital cameras. Um, it was her first tour, and I was front row for a mall concert because I was working at a record store. So I got to take all the photos, and I was doing, uh, me, very, if you see, I'm, uh, I'm a skinny man. Uh, I was doing security and photography for her first tour. True story. I was doing security with, <laughs> with my friends, and I brought some of my, uh, like my friends from the record store, and then I brought other friends just because it was Britney Spears, and it was her, we all knew Baby One More Time. So that's where that photo is. And I, we spent the whole day together. I thought something, I thought we were, I thought there was that connection there. I thought something was, I thought I was going to be her first Jason Alexander or Federline. No. No, and I'll tell you this though, she smelled like watermelon and she was sweet as pie. Britney Spears, right in here, let's go. So here we are. Now this is the Kentwood History Museum. So it's mostly about Kentwood on this side, but we're going in here and we're gonna make a left and it's all Britney from here. Teen Choice Awards, the wings from the Femme Fatale tour. She rose up. There they are, right there. Now, lots of pictures. It gets really cool. I've already been through here once. Autographed photo of Brittany right there. She's been through here a few times. Most of this is on loan from the Spears family. This collection is from Keith Collins. He was a young man who was a big Brittany fan, and sadly, he passed away. He donated this before he passed away. He knew he was he had an inoperable tumor, I believe, I was told. This is all from his collection. You can see it's all in pounds, the, uh, the CDs. This is huge. Crazy CD singles, box set, the singles collection. Um, there's something here I want to show you. I gotta take a look, but there's lots of Britney stuff here. Oh, Femme Fatale tour. Now. 
And he actually did get to meet Brittany, which is very, very cool. Now we're gonna go in here and this is awesome. Circus Tour 2009, love it. All right, lines are down, we're gonna turn around. Take a look at this. This is the headdress she wore on the circus tour. Now if you look in here, there's gonna be a glare, I'm sorry. This is from her starting out. You got some MTV awards. Uh, what, what else is that? Um, Bravo, Challenge for the Children. All sorts of Britney stuff. Autographed hat. Britney Hart hat. Now this sash she's wearing right there, she was Miss Talent USA. And there's the trophy and there's the sash. Right there. So here's a bunch of magazine covers. And this sign, they have a I had a whole bunch, they kept displaying them outside and they keep getting stolen. So now they're inside. Stop stealing signs, people. Come on. Here's some original uh, Mickey Mouse Club, the Musketeers when she joined. There's Brittany right there, Christina Aguilera, Ryan Gosling, JT, Justin Timberlake up here, you got Kerry Russell. Uh, what's his name? <laughs> what's his name from... Uh, uh, you know, from NSYNC. I can't remember his name. JC Chavez. Yeah, I don't know what his name was. And I think I said Carrie Russell. Very cool. And there's Brittany there. Now this, a fan made this in Salem, Oregon. And it lights up. The lights are on. It's a giant stage. With Brittany there in the middle. And he had it shipped here. How cool is that? in one piece from Oregon. The guy's devoted. Now we're seeing plaques and we're seeing gold records. Very cool. Now I'm gonna show you something in a second. There's LL and Dick Clark, but LL Cool J. All of this stuff here was in her bedroom. This is all Britney stuff, Britney's childhood treasures. All of this. Got milk, more magazines. Here we go. This was in her bedroom. And you see right here, one of these pictures. This girl, I believe made it for her. It was her friend, there's her brother. But this was hanging in uh, Britney's bedroom, right there. And we're gonna show you Britney's bedroom in a moment. This is Britney's um, paternal grandmother. This is her, her mother's grandparents. And she was from Britain, and that's where they got the name Britney from. And that's why it's with one T. Now, so all this is really awesome. Oh, I didn't even notice that Mickey Mouse Club script see that umbrella there take a look there it is that's the same umbrella from the circus tour that's it right there really cool so remember that umbrella let's go take a closer look at it Here's where Brittany would sit. Wow. Some circus tour photos. Bunch of people signing the poster here. This is it. This is Britney Spears' bedroom. Right here. The whole, the whole bedroom is right here. How crazy is that? This is it. This is Britney Spears' bedroom. How crazy is that? The family donated her entire bedroom, all the pieces. It's Brittany's bed, the little desk and vanity. 
dresser. Oh, there's a little desk there. So that's more of a, I don't know what you call that. I don't know if she would have an in sync there. But there's that same rabbit there. Right there. That doll is where? Well, there's a couple of dolls over there. But she really likes her dolls. But yeah, that rabbit is right there. So let's take a look at that. So I didn't know it would be behind glass. I thought I was gonna be alone in Brittany's bedroom again, but no, alas, they've got it behind glass, which is kind of smart because I think people would probably lay on the bed and probably try to take things. Look at that. That's her bedroom right there. All donated by the family. How cool is that? Show you again, just so we really soak it in. I decided here was a little bit better to show you. Really get in depth and take a look. Little Brittany grew up here. She was not a girl. She's not yet a woman, but she was Brittany. And so she was actually just a little girl when she lived here, but I think she, about till she was 18, she still lived with her parents. Um, yeah. She really had a lot of a lot of knickknacks and stuff as you saw over there, a lot of toys, stuff to animals. She's a girly girl for sure, growing up. And um yeah, it's so sweet to see all this stuff. We're gonna go to a few other places now, having to do with Britney Spears here. And there's that umbrella, and there we go. Let's go somewhere else having to do with Britney Spears. There's all the knickknacks right there. Off of her bedroom. Well, I want to thank Faye oh, for yeah. staying open for me. Thank you so much, <laughs> Faye. I appreciate it. That was frantic phone calls back and forth. <laughs> but you did it for me, and this is amazing. I'm going to do some more Brittany uh, locations right now, all across Kentwood and Louisiana. I got some good tips. Uh, uh, thank you so much. Hit me, baby. Okay. One more time. <laughs> you know, you know. Yeah. Uh, come on. That was lame. Okay, thank you, Faye. Thank you. Thank you. So normally I do things kind of in order. I would have go to, gone to her childhood home first, or church, school, if I make it to her school. Um, but I was talking to Faye, and she was talking to me about the estate uh, where Brittany's mom lives. And Brittany stays when she comes here, uh, back to Louisiana. And Brittany built when she was 18. And it's right here. And I thought, well, I'll go there first and go double back to the town. Now, I believe the house was built for the Spears family. Brittany and her mom. Jamie Lynn grew up here. And... But don't quote me on that. It could have been an existing house, but I believe it was built. And look at these. See the recycling bins? People come here, fanatical Britney Spears fans, and steal the wheels off the recycling. It's quite a little thing now. These famous gates. This is the Serenity House right here. Britney Spears Mansion. It's a really strange little area. It's actually, it's very, very beautiful. It's a heat wave right now, so it's very hot and green everywhere. And it's all decorated for Christmas, but it's beautiful rolling hills driving to get here. And it's so peaceful. But here it is. There's a car probably is going to come and run me off the road. Look at this estate. Now there are cameras, so we're not going to go too close. We're going to be respectful. I'm going to show you more of the house. You can see one of the houses back there. There's a couple of buildings on the property. I think there's a guest house and a main house and a pool back that way. I'll show you an aerial view. There's those famous gates. Serenity right there how cool is that and then walk around this way there's a little drainage ditch where 18 year old Brittany used to run and play and catch crayfish I made that part up now if we walk down here you're gonna see those are sharp and pointy at the top of each fence you are not something that somebody tried to break one going to get over that fence come take a picture see what you can see there's the house right there. That's Britney Spears' house. That's for Kentwood Estate. Wow. And when we see her childhood home, you'll see the difference. Childhood home is just a, a humble, nice little house. And there's like, like a wishing well up there or something. I'm going to drive down a little bit and show you more. But yeah, right there. Yeah, it's wild. It's just out here. Really quiet. 
Really beautiful. I'm going to drive up a little bit more, see what I can show you. Another thing I was going to say was, uh, you may be surprised, just a little bit about me, like you may be surprised that I, I like Britney Spears, love Britney Spears, and her music too. I defy you to listen to the album Circus from 2009, around that year, and not like at least one song. It is one of the greatest pop albums ever. Every song is good. Now, of course, I love Eminem and N.W.A. You know, I love you too. Like uh, rock and hip hop, but I'm a sucker for pop music. And Britney Spears is the queen of pop. She makes great music, and I'm a Britney Spears fan. Yeah, and I'm glad I got to come out here. What was that noise behind me? Are there bears in Louisiana? Or, uh, there's alligators. I don't know. Okay, you can hear frogs cricketing. Cricketing? What do frogs do? Ribbiting. Stop ribbiting. Um, yeah. So you should take a listen. If you're not a Britney Spears fan, and you're, you're like, why is Scott making a video about Britney Spears? Because. It's Britney, bitch. Come on. It's Britney. And I made one about Justin Bieber. He's a Toronto Maple Leafs fan. That's it. I'm a Toronto Maple Leafs fan. There it is. I got to do one about... I had to do one about Justin to see if he's a... If he's as big as Maple Leaf fan as I am. And Britney, she's beautiful. She's talented. Makes great music. We all love Britney. Free Britney works. I didn't talk about that yet. Conservatorship. All that stuff. Uh, this is more a celebration of Britney and everything. Hometown and stuff. And it's good to see she's living her own life now. And in charge of herself. I don't really know what's all going on with that. I read it all. Kept up with it all. But, you know, all I know is she's free. We love Brittany. Let's see what we can see up here. So there's more of the house. It goes all the way back there. And there's some sort of wishing well up here. That's really nice. Look at that. That is a high fence. Yeah, it's like a swing or a wish. No, it's a wish. It's a well. Can you see? Well, how about that? It is a wishing well. Let's see how long this property stretches for. Let's take a drive along. So this is still all Brittany's. Oh, it ends right here. Oh. Well, that was... Anticlimactic. I thought there'd be more to it. That's huge, though. It's huge. All right, now the home where she grew up in, and where her father lived just up until a year ago. Look at that. I don't know what that is. So here we go. Just a little stop at the First Baptist Church. At where am I? Fifth and Avenue E. Sounds like I'm in New York City, but I'm not. This, hey, was Brittany's family's church, just up the street from her childhood home. Not too far. What, a mile or two, I'm guessing? Well, I'm going there now, I'll find out. But yeah, here's the church they attended. I would imagine that uh, possibly her mom still does. I don't know for sure, but that's it. How you doing? Hi, dog. Okay. And that was a dog, D-O-G, not D-A-W-G. I'm talking to the actual dog, not you, man. You gave me a dirty look. So hey to the dog, not dog. Okay, let's go somewhere else. You would think they'd come to this church. Right here. Greenlaw Baptist Church. You would think. But they didn't. They went to that church. Alright, so here I am on Britney Spears Street. Her childhood street. Right here. Going down there. Now, if you've seen my channel before, maybe you haven't made this first video and you hate me already, that's fine. But maybe you've never... Oh, you're going to make fun of my hair, that's fine too. Call me Bert, that's fine. I get it. Now, if I'm Bert, where's Ernie? Show me Ernie. Now... Her home is right down here. This is deep in Louisiana. It was about um, a five minute drive, about two miles from the church. You gotta be careful. I, I, like I was saying, if you've seen my channel before, I go everywhere and I go right up to famous people's houses and movie houses, anything. I have no shame. Film right up close. Now this house was owned by the Spears family up until about a year ago they sold it. So a new family's living here. I, I know that uh, uh, Jamie Spears, her father, didn't hearken to uh, hearken. He didn't like people necessarily driving by, which they did a lot, taking photos and stuff. And I allegedly he pulled out a gun once. I don't know. Now there's a studio on the property that he used as I, I think he was doing CrossFit training for people. I don't know what's going on, but I can show you pictures of that. I think Brittany used it as an early studio, dancing and practicing, rehearsing that sort of thing. So I'm going to film it. Maybe from the window of my car. I'm not sure how I'm going to do it yet. Uh, I just drove by. I can't tell if anybody's home. See, in Louisiana, you got to be careful because um, every other car, is, every vehicle 
is a pickoff. That doesn't mean anything. I'm just saying it's it's they do things a little differently down here. Everybody has a pet alligator that's trained that they'll pick up and throw at you if you come onto their property. So that's something that I have to be aware of. And the other thing is they could have a gun. Uh, so I'm not afraid, as Eminem would say. But it's a really it's a really isolated house in the middle of nowhere and if they're home I don't know how cool they are about me standing out in front just blah 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 blah. That's Britney Spears childhood home. He just sold it to her father not too long ago but she grew up here and it's pretty cool to be here. <sighs> Smells great out here. Kenwood's a crazy cool little town. It looks like a few things are out of business maybe it's uh, going through some hard times but it's got some beautiful parts. Uh, highly recommend if you're a Britney Spears fan come out here. And if you just want to see the beautiful south, which Louisiana is, come here. Take a look around. All right. Let's go see what we can see at Britney Spears' childhood home. Right down that way. And these are the extra buildings that are on the property coming up. I believe one of these is the studio. Now, there's three extra buildings on the property. I'm not sure which one is the studio. I can't tell. But it's pretty cool. And it looks like kids live here. Uh... So I want to be careful about filming. But yeah, this is Britney's childhood home coming up right here on the left. I sure a lot of Rolling Stone famous photographs taking people magazine came in and take, took photographs. And there it is. It's all done up for Christmas. Very, very cool. The dog barking. He sounds small, but you never know. I do not want an alligator coming and being thrown at me. But yeah. That's Britney Spears' house right there. How cool. That's where she grew up. All right, so that's it. I might, now I might, if I have time, I might try to make it to um, the school she attended up until ninth grade. Park Lane Academy. It's north of here. I'm going west now to do another video about another subject. And then I gotta drive two hours east to where my next video is starting tomorrow. This has nothing to do with Brittany. So it's north of here and I, I mean, she's only there for maybe a year, but I do wanna see it, I do wanna include it. I mean, if I can make it there, I will, if I can make it there, I can make it anywhere. I like to try to make it up there. This could be the end of the video, maybe it's not. Have I said everything about Brittany I wanna say? Remember when it was Britney versus Christina? They get to choose? It's not a choice. There's no choice. Britney rules. And, uh, yeah. <laughs> it's funny it's about the kiss with Madonna on the MTV Awards. How uh, they cut to Justin Timberlake. And then when they cut back, she's kissing Christina Aguilera, Madonna. But it was only Britney that got all the, the hype and hoopla about that. Nothing about Christina. So, and I do like Christina Aguilera. You know, she's fine. But Britney has a lot more hits, I think. More pop hits. Christina's just, you know, it's a little much with the voice and she's doing it. She's, she's a bit of a show off. Britney kept it real. She's, she's just a selling girl who made it be. All right. For all you Britney Spears fans out there, stay stronger. All right. Don't be toxic. And from the bottom of my broken heart, right here. Oh. Amnesia, that's her best song. It's a hidden track. Remember hidden tracks? On Circus. Check out Amnesia. It's such a good song. Now I forget what song I was talking about. <laughs> See? Amnesia. I hate myself too. Okay. Peace. Out. Just at the end of the video here, I thought this was kind of cool. The road I'm on. Can you see that? I don't think I'm going to make it to the school. I'm going to search some photos. But this is the road that's taking me to my next uh, location. What? That's crazy. Oh shit, I left my car door open. People are driving by. Oops. <laughs> Oops, I did it again. I do that a lot. I leave my car door open when I get out just quickly to film something. See? <laughs> oh, I'm clumsy. Get it? <laughs> hey, look at that old bridge. You better work, bitch. All right. Probably I'm not gonna gain many new viewers from this video. <sighs> so I'm just gonna go climb up in there. All right, video's over. <laughs>